Meghan's best friend touches down in London, fashion queen who styles Canada's first lady lands at Heathrow with her husband and three children ahead of royal wedding. Meghan Markle's best friend Jessica Moroni arrived in London with her husband and three children this morning, just 72 hours before the royal wedding. The 37-year-old glossy Canadian socialite touched down at Heathrow Airport with her husband Ben Moroni, son of the country's ex-prime minister Brian Moroni. They were with their three children, twins Brian and John, seven, and daughter Ivy, four, who are rumored to be page boys and flower girl at Saturday's wedding. It comes amid claims Meghan's father Thomas Markle, who lives in Mexico, will not walk her down the aisle in Windsor because he is due to have a heart operation. Professional wedding planner Mrs. Moroni, dubbed the Gwyneth Paltrow of Toronto, runs a bridal store and is said to have helped Meghan choose her gown. Meghan went on holiday with Mrs. Moroni to Positano on the Amalfi Coast in August 2016 in one of her last jaunts as a single woman before her engagement. Their friendship has gone from strength to strength since Meghan, then a young ingenue, moved to Toronto in 2011 to play Rachel Zane in the TV show Suits. By then Mrs. Moroni was married to Ben Moroni, and one of Canada's top television presenters, and mingled with the cream of Toronto society. She introduced Meghan to her social circle, which included Canada's First Lady Sophie Gregory Trudeau, the wife of Prime Minister Justin Trudeau. The former Jessica Brownstein came from a privileged background as a member of Canada's Brown's Shoes dynasty, which is worth a reported pound 50 million. She attended an exclusive all-girls school, before studying industrial relations and economics at McGill University. She then launched a business importing lingerie. After a successful career as a stylist, with her own TV slot, and wedding planner, she was propelled to the A-list in 2008 after marrying Brian Moroni's eldest son. Mrs. Moroni and Meghan are said to have bonded over a passion for yoga, Pilates, dogs and philanthropy, and Meghan calls herself as Andy May to the children. Meghan and Prince Harry are said to have sought refuge at Mrs. Moroni's house when news of their relationship broke. Then last September, as engagement speculation grew, Mrs. Moroni was in a box with Meghan and her mother Doria for the closing ceremony of the Invictus Games. Harry joined them for the final 20 minutes of the show, standing arm in arm with Meghan and planting a kiss on her cheek as they watched Brian Adams sing.